Hello everyone, I'm Mark Gaberti, the teenager and entrepreneur, and I'm very excited about this video series. I'm going to answer all of the questions that you have. A few weeks ago, I asked people if they have questions about getting book sales, social media traffic, how to be productive, and anything in that area like blogging also. So I decided to ask people for their questions and I decided, okay, well, for each question, I'm going to answer it in a video. So if you have a question, please post it in the comments. I like to turn those into videos. So the question for this video, and I, I'm looking down at the computer just so I'm able to read the question properly. It is from Rachel Knowns from copywritingheaven.com. I absolutely love that domain name. The question is, don't you feel that the Kindle marketplace is too crowded now? Many Kindle books are slim on substance and seem to be nothing more than promotional tools for the writer. Instead of delegating other tasks to employees to make more time for writing, why not delegate writing the book to a professional writer instead? Most business owners experience a large learning curve when they start writing a book. It would be easier and faster to farm it out to a ghost writer instead. So the question in sum is, should you consider a ghost writer instead of going all in and trying to learn how to write the book quickly and effectively and also all the time that has to go into writing the book and you have someone write the book for you versus outsourcing all the other little things so it's a question of which one do you want to outsource and whether ghost writing is the right path for you before I go into the ghostwriting part, I'll address the first part of the question, is the Kindle marketplace too crowded right now? And this is a serious question because there's something that Mark Shaver talked about, it's called content shock, where it, all the content out on the web, there's like more content now than we could ever possibly consume in our lifetimes. So the Kindle marketplace has gotten a lot more crowded it is more difficult compared to when Kindle was just getting started out. Basically, the early pioneers got a lot of the reward, but it's never going to be too crowded because no matter how many Kindle books are out there, there is one thing and just one thing that no one else can write content for. Only you are able to write content in this area and that is your personality. You have to insert your personality into the content that you produce because people aren't just going after the content anymore. They want your personality. They want to know you better as an author and as a person. So if you are able to do that with your books and grow an audience through an email list and then promote the Kindle book through your email list, that would help you generate sales for your Kindle book. It's going to continue getting crowded, all of these opportunities. They're just gonna to continue to get crowded, but the people who win are the people who take massive action and also provide something unique to the table. It's harder to do that with content. The personality though, that's one thing that you have that other people do not have. Your personality is unique to you. So now comes the question, should I have a ghostwriter write the books for me so I could do all those other things, just have a ghostwriter, or should I outsource the little tasks so I could open up more time for a ghost writer. Now, my view of outsourcing is you really just wanna outsource as much of your business as you possibly can, except for the essentials that only you can do. Those essentials vary for each person. For me, one of the essentials is writing my own content. I do not have any ghost writers. I thought about it a really long time ago, but it's something that I've never really pursued and I don't really want to because if I put my name on a book, I want to know that that book was all me. I was the one who put the time to write the content. So if you are someone who, when you see your book, you see your name on it and you know it must be yours, then write the books. Do not rely on a ghost writer for that type of stuff. Now, if you are someone who you're only thinking about the books as uh, okay, build Kindle Empire, write a lot of books, make a lot of money, then ghostwriting would help you because when you have a ghostwriter write the book for you, you don't have to do any, any of that part of the business. You could just focus on the marketing side and the ghostwriter writes the book for you. There are some ghostwriters, you could get them really cheap, let's say like 
well, I don't know the rates because I don't have ghostwriters, but there are some people who could get their books written for as little as like, let's say 20 or $30, depending on the ghostwriter. But the point is, if you know how to do the marketing for Kindle and you're only concerned about making revenue from your Kindle books, then yes, hire a ghostwriter because that's the direction that you're heading. If you are an author who wants to write every single book, who enjoys the writing process, then outsource those little tasks that get in the way of you publishing your books. And if you feel pulled, you're undecided, you, a little bit of you wants to do, uh, you want a ghostwriter, but a little bit of you also wants to write your own books, there is a brilliant compromise, a brilliant thing right down the middle, and that is to have a co-author for your book. There are a lot of cases in which people will write Kindle books with another author. There will be two people teaming up to write that book, but when you have two people teaming up to write the same book, there are also two people teaming up to do the same level of promotion. So this is not just a great way to write more books, it is a great way to get more sales and grow your overall audience because if you have 10,000 email subscribers, you write a book with someone who has 10,000 email subscribers and is in your niche, the people on your list are going to hear about the person who wrote the book with you and the person on the co-author's email list are going to hear about you for the very first time. So co-authoring books is something that you could do if you are on the if you are on the balance beam, you don't know which one to do. Co-authoring is just right down the middle. Want to have one of your questions answered in one of my future videos? All you have to do is leave your question down in the comments and I make it a point to reply to all the comments, answer the questions, and then I'll take your questions and turn them into YouTube videos just like this one. If you are someone looking to write a Kindle book in 30 days or less, you do not want the ghostwriter, well, I have a free training course just for you that will show you exactly how to write your next Kindle book or your first one in 30 days or less. And if you are a first time viewer or you are not subscribed to this channel just yet, then click that red subscribe button so I can send you more videos just like this one. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video. That is all for this video. I hope it has served you. And what I want you to do is to dream big, achieve greatness, and unlock your potential today.